So here we are uh, with uh, DM EV mobile service here. They're going to be putting in a charge into my Tesla. Now this service here is pretty cool. They just came out, I scheduled it online. And now they're going ahead and charging my car. Here we go. It's 35. Now my battery is fully conditioned and I would expect somewhere between 35 and 50, depending on the battery state of their charger. But this is really good just to get um, a charge on your car if you needed to. We've got this charge here. I kind of talked with the guys here. The service is uh, pretty active here. They're doing two or three of these demos every day. Um, they're on their second week, so it's pretty cool. I am getting 35 kilowatts and I'm just going to go out here. I'll show you some of their equipment. It's pretty state of the art and they have two um, services that they provide. The first service that they provide is emergency charging. So if you happen to run out of battery charge, you can call these guys up and they will come out and do a uh, portable battery charge and I'll show you that. Now it does come in a couple flavors. They've got a subscription fee as well. Looks like on their website you can pay a one-time service fee to get yourself out of uh, trouble. Contact a tow company and they would load your car up on it on a flat deck and then move it along. So this is a really good uh, option for those situations. And then the second option that they have is a subscription charge service where as an example you might be at your home or at work that you don't have charging ability and they will come and charge your car on a scheduled service so that so you can have a uh, battery charged uh, at your convenience. So anyway, let's go take a look at the, uh, the equipment. It's pretty cool. So here's the uh, battery component they have. They have extinguisher service here, so just in case, so they're safety compliant. Uh, down in this box here, I'm thinking they've got a battery. I think it was like 120 or something, if I remember from the website. Yeah. yeah. And then so they can charge any car from this. It's very similar to the Chevron on the go where they charge this and then this system charges your car. Now, um, you can see right here, we're using a uh, CCS adapter. So they do carry those because that's their adapter, which works out really well. So you don't have to bring one if you're a Tesla owner. Um, you cover Chatamo as well. That's so they, they cover all the standards, so that's perfect. And then, can I see one of those? Uh, yeah. So back here, this is uh, the rest of their equipment. You can see that uh, these batteries right here, they're portable. So if you're in a situation, if you're in a situation where um, you're in emergency, they can carry this out to your car if they can't reach it by the van and then charge it up and, and you can move it to a better location. But these are capable of, I think, seven or eight kilowatts, so a level two charger. And you can see they have all the cables that are needed. And then you can actually see back there the components. It's pretty state of the art. I, I really like this. What's this one here? Is this different? Yeah. Oh, so this is the support. Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, so this is the one that you put on the car, and then you can stack these to get more power if you want to. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. Okay, so here's the guys here. They're they're really helpful. We kind of chatted for at least. I don't know, 15, 20 minutes on the technology, and then they decide to... Uh, these are the guys that have gone out to a buddy of mine, Donovan, and did his uh, Nissan Leaf. I think they did the EV6 as well, right? Right, And he was really happy with it. And so I figured I'd give it a shot and see what I thought about the service. So the service is pretty cool, uh, really for all EVs. So I'm really happy that uh, they're supporting everybody. There is some lack of technology for the general EV community. So yeah, this is really good. And uh, I'd like really like to thank you guys for coming out. Thank uh, you very much. Here. Yeah, it's it's really cool. Um, do you have any questions for me at all? Um, I, no, I think it was a great time we had together yeah. today.
Thank you for your Tesla knowledge. Too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm sure we'll talk a bit anyway. Is it okay if I put a link down in my description for you guys? Sure. I'll website. Yeah. 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 And I'll I'll make sure I uh, post this on my YouTube channel for you guys. Thank yeah. you so much. I, I think it's uh it's a technology we need, especially for those that are less knowledgeable about EVs. Right. Right. Yeah. So I just uh, finished the charging session with DM EV Solutions here at South Point Mall out, out here in South Surrey. They, I had scheduled them to come out. So at 12.30, they showed up sharply at 12.30 and uh, we got into the whole thing. So they made sure that uh, my car was at a appropriate state of charge. Um, they let me know that they could charge uh, do an emergency charge or a full on charge because it's in the pilot program. So I got them to just do a charge. So they used the Tesla CCS adapter that they carry in the van and connected it to my car and I was getting 35 kilowatts. So that's pretty good. Uh, again, I'm not looking for high speeds on this and I don't think anybody should be uh, expecting super high charge rates from this. Their solution really is for those that have uh discharge their battery to a low enough state of charge that they can't get to another charger and so you might not be completely dead but you don't have enough of a charge to get to a charger and you would need to contact them so again i think the emergency one is the best uh business model for this because it's in cost wise similar to or possibly cheaper than having a flat deck truck come, load up the truck and drive it whatever distance it is to a charger that you can get your charge on. So I think that's the best solution here. But again, there are people out there that are willing to pay more money to have the charger come to them once or twice a week and charge up their car. So yeah, it's really good. I really enjoyed my discussion with these guys. Uh, they had a lot of information that they provided to me. We talked about EVs and they had some good questions about uh, charging rates and where I charge and where where I feel that this solution actually fits into the market. So we talked quite a bit about it. I was really happy about that anyway. Uh, if you're interested in finding out more information about this solution, I've got a link down in the description and go ahead and check them out. Their service was outstanding and I would recommend them to anybody, especially if they're in a situation where their battery is low or dead and they can't get to a charger. Thanks for watching.